<laughs> fuck with the long flights. <laughs> we out here for my bitch's 25th birthday. And right, honestly, right. y'all, Dubai wouldn't have told me if it was for this bitch. <laughs> when I tell y'all she big, he didn't cry for me to come here to be Jada Chiefs, also known as Jada Waiter on social networks, found herself stumbling and falling to the ground after leaving a lounge in Dubai. She toe up. Bitch, I'm toe up, school. I'm toe up, school. I'm toe up, school. No, no, no. While I don't aim to judge Jada, her actions in Dubai raise important questions about responsible tourism, cultural sensitivity, and the consequences of reckless behavior in a foreign country. Jada's extravagant lifestyle is her own choice, but when it results in a blatant disregard for local customs and laws, it becomes a matter of concern. Jada is undeniably a very successful and attractive woman, but her public display of drunkenness in Dubai, a city known for its strict regulations, is difficult to understand. Why put oneself in a situation that seems to taunt the Dubai government and its strict policies on alcohol and behavior. It's important to remember that Jada doesn't represent all black women. Women and people in general are not monolithic. Her actions do not reflect the behavior and values of an entire group. What is truly disappointing was Jada's response on social media after the incident. What is it finna play? Wow! Rather than using her influence and platform to educate her millions of fans about the importance of respecting local laws and customs when visiting a foreign country, she brushed off the incident. The majority of her fans do not share her wealth and connections, and they could possibly face severe consequences in Dubai if they were to repeat her actions. Dubai has opened its doors to American tourists hoping to boost its economy with visitors who spend substantial amounts of money on hotels and luxury shopping. While it's great to see women, especially black women, living their best carefree life, whatever that means to them, it's equally essential to be mindful of the cultural and legal differences when traveling abroad. It's crucial for potential tourists to grasp the consequences of their actions may be vastly different from what they would face in their home countries. Dubai laws regarding alcohol are strict and they come with a zero tolerance policy for drunken behavior and drunk driving. These smart tourists would definitely avoid any actions that could resemble controversy in a foreign country. Jada's case could potentially be another instance of an American tourist being allowed to leave Dubai but then arrested upon their return. These incidents should serve as a stark reminder to tourists that Dubai enforces its rules seriously. She toe up, bitch. I'm toe up, school. I'm toe up, school. Jada's actions in Dubai were not only irresponsible, but also reflected a lack of cultural sensitivity and awareness. While she may escape the full consequences of her behavior due to her money and desirability, her supporters and other potential tourists may not be as fortunate. Understanding the local laws and customs when traveling abroad is vital to ensure a safe and enjoyable experience for all involved. Thank you all for the continued support. Please like, share, and subscribe for more videos. Bye!